uh, in this uh, tutorial, I have escaped the uh, the um, installation process. So this is the very last step once your installation is completed. Unfortunately, in this case, um, there is a failure, which is not really uh, the important one, but it's just uh, like documentation components failed. Uh, but no need to worry for that. Uh, I mean, uh, I'm sure in your case, um, this probably uh, would be success. It depends on your what sort of configuration you have in the past as well. Um, uh, so uh, this is the very final steps for installation. And after that, you can close it. And then you go to application here. Um, and just to check whether the installation is completed or not. And after that, here is the... Um, installation one um so there you go um this is the uh, this is the one where uh, once you install your application then you should you should be able to see these uh, sql server services which are running and not running uh, you can see it here, um, SQL Server reporting services is running and then SQL Server itself is running. This is the main one where you need to look for. So in, in, in this case, the SQL Server instance 2014 um, is running. It means the installation is successfully completed. Um, and if you... Um, if you want to do connect your uh, previous database uh, or if you want to create new database um, please follow on the next video thank you very much for watching this video and please subscribe me on youtube channel thank you